If you want to keep up your motivation and be proud of what you've already reached with YouTube, then here is maybe a small motivation booster. With this little subscriber counter, you can see every time how your YouTube channel is growing. Now let's start to build this small project. For the subscriber counter, I used the Adafruit Husa ESP8266 Wi-Fi module and the display is a 4 digit 7 segment display with the backpack, which is also from Adafruit. For more details you can look at the description below. You can connect these two components very easy together with the I2C bus. You just need to solder the 7 segment with the backpack together. Be careful that you solder the 7 segment display on the right side up. After this you connect the 4 wires from the Wi-Fi board and the 7 segment board together. Connect the SCL from the Wi-Fi board to the pin C from the 7 segment board. Then SDA to D then for the power connection from 3V to plus and at last from ground to minus. Next step is to test the circuit. If it works, then you put out the foam to the right side and glue it together. At the end, you cut out the printing template and then you put it on the piece of wood and finally cut out the hole for the display. After you click on the link at the description below, you come to these folders. Then click on the first folder, click to the link and copy this link. Then you go to Arduino, to File, Preferences and then put it here inside. Then click OK. After this step, you go to Tools, Boards Manager, and then search for Adafruit. And then you find this. And then install not the newest version, because with me it didn't work with the newest version. I installed the 2.4.2 version. Then install it and close it. After you have installed it, you can see it on tools, board, and then choose it add a fridge feeder. Click it. And now you need to change the parameters. This, this, and this one. And the book port to serial. And the other things. You need to connect the board. After you connected it, you should see it. Uh, Come on. After you connect it, you can see it's with me the port 7, COM 7. Then 
you go to the second step and you download this these four libraries and if you have downloaded these four libraries you can go to sketch include library at sit library and you can uh, open it I have already opened it and uploaded it and then you can go to the search tab and open this test program copy this go back to Arduino and copy it inside then you can upload it and if the red LED blinks then you did it correct after then you can go to the fourth step and you can copy the program from here inside the Arduino. Go to Arduino and copy it inside. Then you need to change, or you you need to change this. And uh, you you need to put the Wi-Fi network here. Password, API key, and channel ID. For the API key. You can click on this link, then you get to this this page. Click to apps and service, and you should go. You should come to this site. Then go to traditionals, tradition jail epic key and yeah, there's your epic key you can copy it here then you go back to arduino and put it inside here and for your channel ed id you go to your channel here my channel and copy and copy this link just this and put it inside your channel ID then you need to give your network Wi-Fi network and your password and that's all then you can open the serial monitor here look that it is on on this pout right and you can upload it then you can see that the program works it connected with the Wi-Fi and now you can see the subscriber count on your display Then you are finished with the programming. You just need to go back to the, the folder and you can download here these two layouts. And if you uploaded it, you can mark it, right click, print it, and then you can put this and print and finish and that's all thank you so much for watching my video if you liked the video then give me a thumbs up also if you don't want to miss the next video then subscribe to my channel stay productive and i hope i will see you in my next video